In this video, I'm going to add a favicon to a layer, a Nuxt project that I will use as a layer, consumed in two other Nuxt projects, and I will see if I can override the favicon. See how this works. I will also, in this video, change the way that I import. No, I won't. I'm just going to stick to the favicon. So I just need to be able to see the favicon, and there we go. Let's make a little more room here. All right. So in my Nuxt UI, I have a public folder and a favicon with my initials. This project is a bare bones Nuxt application. It has a very simple configuration. I use the Nuxt UI module. So I know that already that material gets exported into the HTML document produced by the other, by the host Nuxt project. Let's see if the favicon is also consumed by the host Nuxt project. So I have two host projects. Let's just do one at a time here. Now, oh, I've recently added this file to this build. So I think what I should do is Nuxy prepare, and then I'll do a Nuxy build just to be just to be safe. I don't know what these routines do exactly, but I know that I've run into trouble in the past. If I do a Nuxy dev right or a preview, let's do a preview. So this would be like production setting. And over here in the browser, I am not seeing a favicon. So this favicon is not updating. Even though I do have it here, do I have to tell Tailwind that there's a favicon somehow? to tell view. All right, let's see. In my Nuxt config over here, see if I can add some detail here. This should be head. Not in dev mode, so it wouldn't have updated. It wouldn't have hot reloaded. Let's go into dev mode where I can hot reload and see if uh, I can set the app, this Nuxt app, in the head of the Nuxt app, there shall be a meta tag link and a link element, sorry, not a meta, but a link element with these attributes, a relation to icon type, image X icon, favicon PNG, beat server warmed up. I'm looking at that favicon there. It's not, not working yet. So these instructions are not working. Oh, it is working. Look at that. So the favicon is updated. Notice DS, and, and I didn't notice when that happened. So that's interesting. So. I don't need the, the preceding slash, and I can update this. I'll do a hard refresh. This is working. All right. Now, do I even need this line? Is it just interesting? I don't know that I need this line. It could be that it's just cached at this point. Oh, so I'm emptying the cache and a hard refresh to see if the favicon is now Looks like I don't need this, actually. This code is erroneous. Let's see. So Nuxy build. Let's do a Nuxy prepare. Nuxy build. Nuxy preview. I'm going to do a hard refresh. And the favicon is found. Let's see if I remove this. I'll rename it to nothing.text. All right. Now let's see. Prepare, build, preview. Let's hard refresh and empty the cache. And it's still there. It's cached. Ugh. Let's do a new browser. Localhost 3000. Welcome to Nuxt. So the other a dev, Nuxy dev 3000. With dev tools open, I should be able to right click up here and do an empty cache, hard reload. Fine. Good. So it's not picking up this favicon. Let's rename this favicon.png. And now we'll say hard refresh. Veet server is warmed up and hot reload. Now, if I change the Nuxt configuration to point to this favicon and do a hard refresh. Oh, it's uh, rebuilding here, hold on. And the favicon has been updated. So I guess I do need this code. It's difficult to tell because things get cached weirdly and emptying the cache doesn't apparently empty the cache. But I was able to confirm that in another browser Back in my original browser, I should be able to empty this cache and see the favicon. There we are. Now, I'm going to leave, well, I'll close my Brave browser for now. Now, in the other 
I'll CD out of this folder and I'll CD into the employment link. Notice I have another folder where, so, so I have a folder containing project materials and then I have a, another folder which has the Nuxt app in it. So I'm going in there now. I call this the employment link Apex. That's my thing. Apex is the Apex domain. I'll have subdomains as well. So I'm, I'm using the Apex as a meaningful thing for me. Employment link Apex. In this folder, I should be able to say PNPM install. Oh, I haven't yet. Let's go to the other folder where I've already embedded the layer. So sorry, I'll go into the range. And then, so now I'm in the range Apex. Let's just verify what we're doing here. In the range folder, I have a Nuxt app here. And I in the public folder, I already have a, why is that? I want to remove that for now. And I should see my initials as the favicon for range without doing any other modification to this Nuxt application. So I'll say Nuxy dev. So the layer has a configuration for the app, which injects a egg into the head of the document to point to this favicon in the layer. I'm now running the Nuxt project, which consumes that layer. And I expect that that same HTML link should be injected into the head of the document. In other words, the host Nuxt app should just inherit the, config, the app configuration of, of the layer. We'll see if it does. And it's loading. And what is the favicon that appears? My initials. There we go. So that's really cool. Let's see if I can override that. So the app config already points to, oh yes, close that. So here's the, here's the link that gets produced by the layer. Here's what I'll do next is I'm just going to replace the PNG. So I'm not going to change the Nuxt config in, in the host project at all. I'm just going to override the PNG file with a new one with the same name in the public folder. And I have the file here, so I'm just going to grab the fire. I'll call it favicon, favicon, favicon. Oh, I can't do that. Sorry, I have to get it out of the folder first. Now I can rename it. This was faster anyways. And let's do a hard refresh. So did the Vite server do, the, there was no hot reload here, by the way. Uh, I guess let's do a little app view, say hello from the range with new favicon. Boop. Now there will be a hot reload and we'll see if the public folder also gets hot reloaded. Empty the cache. It does. Look at that. It's overridden. 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 Lovely. Cool. So the other, I have another favicon for the other project. Now I haven't worked as much with the other project, so there's a few things I should do. So one of them will be to grab this thing here, which says extends, and I'll put that into this folder. So the next config in the other project says hey, let's extend this app with this layer called my Nuxt UI, which is located at this path. It's just a local path that climbs out of the, this Nuxt project and then down into the other Nuxt project. CD here. A few things will break, I expect. So while I do this, I'll CD into employment link. I will, while I'm here, CD into the actual Nuxt project, thank you. While I'm here, I'll say pnpm install, because I haven't done that here in a while. Uh, I'm not sure what will happen as a result of this command. And while I'm waiting for all that to work, so next prepare is being run as a post install routine. I get it. In the public folder here, I'm going to delete the favicon mm -hmm. that was created by default. And I will put this money bags in here so that'll be the favicon for the employment link. Great. So the, I guess, can I just try Nuxiev and we'll see if everything works as intended. This should now say app.view hello from employment link with new favicon. Notice the fire here, which is cached at this URL, 
and we'll see if things change. I might have to empty the cache when this Nitro server gets fully up and running or the Veep server. Veep server. Nitro server takes a little while. Nuxt Nitro server took 29 seconds and the Veep server is now warmed up. Let's just see what happens. The Favicon, is it the new one? No, it's the fire. So let's uh, empty the cache and hard refresh. This should be the money bags. We should see the money bags. There it is. So we had to just empty the cache and refresh. The money bags is there. I have now confirmed that Nuxt layering is working as I intend. So my Nuxt UI is a layer that's being consumed by the other two. My Nuxt UI has a favicon configured in the Nuxt config file. The other two do not have a favicon configured. It just inherits the configuration from the layer. And then I can override the PNG, the actual icon, in, in the child, or in this case, the host apps, not the child apps, but the hosts. That's cool. It's working. Thanks for watching.